Don't mind me, I'm just entering this video like a PowerPoint animation. If you bought Popular Science this week, you already know what my latest project is because I wrote an article for them about it. And if you haven't, you should because I look really good in the picture and that doesn't happen very often. Especially if you have like a super pro photographer coming and shooting you and you're all like, Oh. I got the idea when I was at a conference and I just had to clap my hands a lot But my poor developer hands just started hurting after some time So I thought there must be a better way I realize this is kind of like the slogan of my channel because finding a better way is all I do You're welcome world this is probably one of the most well-polished projects I've ever built. I even like etched its name into here in the front in silver. How pretty is that? Very pretty. Good job, Simone. Thanks, Simone. The trickiest part about building this was probably just figuring out this entire clapping mechanism. These are actually a pair of tongs from my kitchen. And I have this motor with an oval motor head thing. Motor mount? What is, yeah, it had, you can see it. And I put this metal spring between the, the grippers. So basically the motor just forces the hands open and then they just like, these are just some hollow plastic hands that I got. They actually look really creepy. They're like an old person's hands. I normally prefer young people hands. Uh, ooh. So basically how this is set up is I have an Arduino Uno inside of here and it's connected to a MOSFET. So we can control the speed of this motor and I have this slider so the speed can go from snarky slow clap to breakneck speed. Let's give it a go. So here we have snarky slow clap. So as you can tell, it has some work to do on the audio quality. I don't know what it sounds like. It sounds like something that shouldn't sound like that. If you have an eye for detail, you can see that it's actually two right hands that are clapping because there were no left hands left. But I really hope you like this project anyway. If you did, I suggest you press the like button. And if you haven't already, you should definitely subscribe to my channel because... And uh, old person's hands. Either way. Talk to you later.